Oh, another absolutely beautiful day in crypto land. I'm here catching some fresh air, but meanwhile, Axie Infinity is exploding to all time highs, $120, a $6.7 billion market cap circulating, and a $30 billion fully diluted valuation for a, a very simple video game that has given its ownership, has given the memes of production to its users. The power of Web3 decentralized building is being shown right now in front of you. Meanwhile, NFTs are breaking all-time highs. Cool cats, we see Nifty League crushing it. Again, we brought this to you about 0.15. I think it hit as high as 0.45 earlier today, and some of these are going for five plus Ethereum, absolutely monstrous. I'm doing everything I can to unlock this for you, to unlock the keys and help you look around the corners to understand where the value might sit. Now, personally, I think that Axie, every time it pumps, well, we know every time it pumps, the gaming coins come along with it. Yield Guild is moving, UFO is moving, Play to Earn is going to move hard as Axie Infinity does its thing. So if you're looking for or plays in the market this weekend, try to catch the lazy smaller cap ones that are gonna play catch up to Axie Infinity. That's an easy, easy copycat play. You look for the little brother of the big one pumping. Super easy to do. Now I want you to understand, we just saw Pixel Vault make a deal with WME to have their Web3, their decentralized IP featured in mainstream film and television. So what we know comes next is that these assets will most likely start crossing over to mainstream, just like we saw CryptoPunks and most likely we'll see Bored Apes soon as well. We already saw Time Magazine cover the Cool Cats. What we're doing right now is the next Marvel, is the next Disney, is the next big IP here. And it's gonna be worth even more, just like these particular networks are worth more than the incumbent prior networks. Why Coinbase is worth more than the other banks out there because the Web3 blockchain-based solutions and products, the decentralized products that are built by villages, but not by a single shop, those will always be stronger when you leverage the power of the crowd. So what comes next? Other play to earn. They're going to follow on the tail of Axie. Just like I said, this is a multi probably a multi-decade play here, which is blockchain-based gaming. But in my opinion, in four or five years, every single game will be blockchain-based. It is just a matter of time and video games will come to be the most powerful, highest valued protocols in the world. Axie, I think, just pushed up into the 20s. Soon it'll be a top 20 protocol here. Axie Infinity AXS, wrap your head around that and how absolutely monstrously big this is. Just so you know, I told you first, Gaming is going to take over the blockchain. It's going to eat it. I also told you that Play to Earn will follow on the wake of Axie's success, and I've been helping you unlock mega gains here in NFT land. I mean, normally a multi-100% gain would be something to go home and really dance and celebrate. So I hope you guys have been enjoying it, and I'm going to keep doing my work to expose you to the best opportunities in the space. Yes, I own Axie. Yes, I own UFO. Yes, what else did I say that I talked about that I own here? I, yes, I own Nifty League. Um, Yes, I own Cool Cats. I just want you guys to know the things that I own, that I talk about, so it's clear uh, where I sit. But for the most part, if I'm excited about something, I'm gonna buy it. Uh, and yeah, that's just how I operate. I FOMO in when I think something's really good. Call me crazy. Anyway, I'm Elio Trades. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. There's a lot more coming, a lot more value. The team keeps growing, the value keeps growing, and together, I do believe we're all gonna make it. You can find me on Twitter at Elio Trades, and I'll see you very soon on the next episode.